It is the President's responsibility to nominate, and it is our responsibility to vet those nominees. But here we are today with a unique circumstance in which the leadership of this body has said, we are not going to fulfill the responsibility that's given to us under the Constitution. We're going to unstrike. We don't want to do our job. I think the American people are saying the opposite. Senate, do your job. And the leadership of this body is saying that they're not going to do their job for 317 days, not going to meet with a nominee, not going to hold a committee meeting on the nominee, not going to report that to the floor, not going to hold a floor debate, not because of the standard set up in the Constitution, not because of the standard, is this a fit character? Is he or she fit by qualifications? And is he or she fit by judicial te temperament? The standard of unfit character, no. We're going, this is a strike, a job strike based solely on partisan politics. Bringing partisan politics into the very place it should never be, confirmation of our judges. And not 100 days, but more than 300 days, totally out of sync with the history of this nation totally out of sync with the responsibility that each of us is assigned to help provide advice and consent. But unfortunately, we're hearing a very different story at this moment from the Republican leadership in this body, and it's an embarrassment. It's an embarrassment to this chamber. It's an embarrassment to our responsibility. And I certainly am appealing that it be remedied. To summarize, the Constitution lays out the job before us. The American citizens expect us to do our jobs. Let's do our job.